it comes. What's up guys? Jared and I are here in Northwestern Utah and we just pulled up to the Bonneville Salt Flats and it is so surreal. It is massive. Check this out. This used to be a old lake, which it is no longer now. It is just this massive, white, flat, salty land. There goes a fast car. Okay, so that is also what this land is known for. Do you guys see that? Ah! Jared, how fast is he going? How fast? No, he's not. Oh my gosh, he is going to try to convince me to let him drive Penny as fast as he can and I am not gonna let him. Um, but that's also what this is known for because it is so flat. So there are like world record racing stats here and we are not going to break them. But we are going to maybe break it on our feet cause I'm gonna go on a little run here. I'm really excited. Um, perfect weather, could not recommend this more to you guys. Um, hope you enjoy this video. Up run and now I'm going to do a quick four exercise circuit. The first exercise is pull-ups using our custom pull-up bar. We actually had it redesigned. If you guys saw some previous videos, our bar extended off the side and it just wasn't super sturdy. Jared kind of did pull-ups at an angle and it just wasn't working. So we had it redesigned and I'm super excited to use it today. Um, so pull-ups and then we're gonna do incline push-ups body squats and toes to bar. Um, and the scheme, the rep scheme is a descending ladder. So I'm gonna start at seven reps, do seven reps of every exercise, then six reps, then five, all the way back down to one, as fast as possible. Let's get to it. All right, I'm gonna get my watch going in three, two, one. Let's go, starting with four. <laughs> Margarita. Oh my god. <laughs> So I'm gonna make a post workout stack and then we should do some driving. I'm so excited. Are you gonna let me drive? I mean, yeah, you know, you can we'll put in third gear for you. All right, here we go. Oh gosh, we're running low. We're running low. Here we go. We keep our water filter in place with our little bungee cord. Should have removed. <laughs> <laughs> That's about right. <laughs> that was so close. Okay. So this is like our little trick. When we don't want it to look ugly, we take that off, which I forgot to do. So now you guys know our secret. So this is what I take after every single workout. About a cup of water and then a scoop of my ignition. This is actually half a scoop. Um, 
and then a full scoop of my formula one protein. This helps me recover faster, so I feel less sore for my next workout. Helps me build lean muscle, and it helps my body burn fat more efficiently. Tastes amazing. Couldn't recommend it more. I'm gonna chug this down so we can go have some fun. Mm. Cheers. All right, I am caramelizing a quarter of a yellow onion here in my Dash mini skillet. This is perfect for van life. It's super small and compact and easy to clean. I sprayed it with some nonstick olive oil spray. And then I'm gonna scramble some whole eggs and some turkey sausage after the onions are finished. You can use any type of breakfast meat, but I love this Jimmy Dean fully cooked turkey sausage. And then I'm going to wrap it all up in these Extreme Wellness large tortillas. In the past, I've only used the smaller wraps and I just discovered that they make large ones as well. And they are awesome, super macro friendly. And I'm also gonna top it off with some guac and some plain Greek yogurt and some sliced cherry tomatoes and a little bit of Portland ketchup because I love my Portland ketchup. All right, change of plans. We are no longer eating breakfast burritos for dinner or any warm food for that matter because our battery keeps shutting off every time we plug something in. We had the skillet plugged in for about five minutes and it shut off and we have no idea why. The, the lights are miraculously still on, um, but they might shut off at any moment. Um, we're trying to figure out the problem. Jared's in the back uh, looking at the battery right now, but it should be working. We had plenty of sunlight today um, but that's van life for you guys uh, we are constantly running into problems whether that is finding parking for the night finding space and now finding warmth and battery um, but we will make it work it's what we signed up for and every day is a new adventure um, so in the meantime I'm going to use this canned chicken breast that I keep in the van for cases of emergency like this it actually tastes really good I have a lot of recipes using it chicken salad um, so I'm going to use the half cooked caramelized onions and all the other ingredients besides the eggs and the turkey sausage and I'm going to make a wrap out of it and make it work it's going to be delicious and we're going to figure this out all right, so I drained the canned chicken breast and I poured the chicken directly in the cold skillet. It was already dirty, so I might as well use it as a mixing bowl. Then I added a dollop of some plain Greek yogurt, some salt and pepper, mixed it all up with the caramelized onion, and I think it's gonna turn out really good. So now I'm going to wrap them all up using a little bit of guac in the middle. I'm not using a plate because a couple less dishes we have to do. So I'm just doing this directly on the countertop. I'm gonna top it off with some cherry tomatoes. Little extra salt and pepper. And there you have it. There's dinner. Wasn't what we planned, but that's okay. Thank you.
Now I can stay right here. Time to go on. It is about 7.45 and it is only like 42, 43 degrees right now and so it's a little chilly. Um, I'm going on a walk while Jared works. He's on some phone calls right now so I'm giving him some space. I don't know if you guys can see Penny in the distance. Oh yeah, there it is, he's over there. Um, gosh, it is the weirdest thing walking on this salt, you guys. It, it looks and kind of feels like I'm on the snow. It's crunchy and white but it's not it's salt it's completely dry um it's just so weird it's so beautiful you guys have to check this place out um but oh my gosh my eyes are watering right now from the cold um normally right now i would be making us a delicious warm cup of protein coffee however our electrical is still not working properly so i'm waiting for the sun to get higher so that we can use our solar panels that's normally what we rely on for power um except of course when the sun goes down and it's dark um and unfortunately last night our batteries just weren't working and so i think we're actually going to have to go get them replaced unfortunately they're like brand new um so i don't know what's going on but um anyways so gonna walk for a little while and then um, head back hopefully make some protein coffee and then do some work because it's only a Tuesday and we do work I get a lot of questions about how we live in the van how we afford it do we rely on our savings or what do we do to make money and I plan on eventually creating a more elaborate video for you guys explaining what we do for our careers. Um, but no, we don't rely on our savings. I own a health and fitness business, CPT Fitco, and then Jared works remotely for a supplement company called First Form. That's the company that I'm also affiliated with. That's how we met. Um, and he's able to work on the road. I'm able to work from wherever I'm at because my business is 100% online. I sell online fitness programs um, and I also uh, work with some brands and I have some other things up my sleeve coming this year. So I'm super excited about that. Stay tuned. Speaking of, I should probably turn around and start working. So I will show you guys a little bit of our morning routine, uh, our daily work routine, um, because it is only a Tuesday. So we have a lot of work to do today. Then I will hopefully make breakfast. We'll see it might turn into cold oatmeal or a protein bar um, depending on if our electric decides to work um, so it doesn't matter we'll make it work no matter what I'm not too worried about it but yeah I'm excited to show you guys and then we will be off on our next adventure have no idea where we're going um, but it's gonna be fun made it back home oh hey, oh, hey. How what's you up walk? cold out there. I'm hungry. Can I make breakfast yet and coffee? Um, I think the sun needs to come up just a little more. So I don't think I'm ready yet. No. Protein bar? Mmm. <laughs> I'm down. <laughs> <laughs> I am too. All right, protein bars for breakfast it is. What do we got? Chocolate crunch. Ooh, pumpkin spice crunch. All right, breakfast is served. Mm, man, how long these are you actually? Make this? <laughs> these are actually so good that I don't even care. We have one of these, at least one of these every single day. Mm -hmm. Let's see that one. Chocolate crunch. Mm. One of my favorites, the first one. Tastes like a candy bar. Mm -hmm. Is too good to be a protein bar. It's so cakey and crunchy on top. Finally. 
taking a little break. I'm doing some rooftop stretching while Jared does some rooftop droning. <laughs> droning, huh? <laughs> We wanted to stay another night, but unfortunately, when the sun goes down, we lose our electric and we have to get new batteries. So that's what we're about to do. But before we go, Jared is letting me take Penny on one last spin over the salt flat. And he would be driving, except he's driving something else right now. Woo! <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching the video. We cannot wait to show you our next adventure. See you next time. Bye. Say bye. Bye guys. See you soon. out there don't cut it let it go <laughs>